look at this this is where we're having our first meeting would you look at that oh my goodness they call it the trouser le pantalon <laughs> the trouser isn't that just incredible Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa uh, uh, barakatuh. I find myself on my speech. Uh, uh, yes, here. yes, this yeah. This is just beautiful and quite, quite awe-inspiring, isn't it? Uh, our so this is this is showing us um, very, very early uh, parchment yes. writings and calligraphy from yep. the from the uh, Holy Quran. Yes, and uh, uh, one that we've stopped at here. Right now, if you can just turn yeah. around and give a viewing of this this, this here. particular one it's hard to, uh, it, it's incredible is it absolutely incredible so this is from surah al maida mm -hmm. chapter which is holy quran chapter 5 uh, and this is uh, verses uh, 18 to 29 mm -hmm. uh, written written in the seventh, seventh century, century AD. AD. That's the six hundreds. So given that uh, our uh, beloved uh, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam um, lived in that century. Lived in that century. This is quite literally the the word of Alhamdulillah. And re recorded either at the time or very soon after and it, it's it's just it's it's mind blowing just to be here it says that these scripts are very rare i i i, I can understand why just the fragility of it first of all um and it says it's dated it says it was from arabia probably mecca or medina uh, and dated from the seventh century as we say the 600s uh, that is the, it's the century in which our prophet muhammad peace be upon him lived so this recorded it it, it uh, it's, it's, it's i'm tingling there's a strong possibility this wasn't this hasn't copied other texts to, to pass the word on this may well have been a record of what was said at what the was time. said at the time alhamdulillah. alhamdulillah we had to share this with you we've been brought by our amazing host to what is just an incredible uh, this, this is in fact museum of calligraphy museum. it's not just calligraphy this is this is uh, artwork yes it's, uh, it's uh, it jewelry is, it's it, it, Islamic weaponry. inspired it, it, it's, ever, it's a personal collection yes that this family have, have, uh, have gathered yep. over a lifetime yes and yeah now it's on on show here on in display museum in and, Kuwait. And, and in such an unassuming so. building uh, we came in and it, it, it is it's, it's I mean you've heard the term it's like walking into an, an Aladdin's cave it is you, you come through these these doors and immediately you, you're confronted by beauty and things that are st st staggeringly interesting yeah. and you think oh this is going to be a relatively small and then you, you you go down into this place and it's vast and we just walk around mouth agape um, we're looking at clothes we're looking at jewelry yeah. and then we find ourselves with these manuscripts and, and, and to see this is just mind-blowing mind-blowing we're just looking at this Lauren yeah, you're um, okay. uh, it is a manuscript mm -hmm. but it's dated 7th century AD that's so 600 that's the first century of Hitra so this is this is at the time at the time yeah. so this is quite possibly somebody who's written this having heard it Mm. And then recorded it mm. like this. And this is chapter 5, Surah Al Maida. Yes. Yeah. Versus, Versus 18, 18 to 29. 18 to 29. So, which ones are those then? Well, you just read that. Would you, oh, would you read you? that again? Because yeah, it yeah, it's beautiful. And the Jews and the Christians say, We are the sons of Allah and his beloved ones. Say, Why does he then chastise you for your faults? Nay, you are mortals from among whom he has created. He, he forgives whom he pleases, 
and he chastises whom he pleases. And Allah's is the kingdom of the heaven and the earth and what is between them. And to him is the eventual coming. Alhamdulillah. And that was recorded. Wow. 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 <laughs> Just mind blowing. Just have to show you this extraordinary thing. This, just to give some perspective, there's my hand. So this is the writing. This is the writing. This is written on cloth, on cotton, and I, I, I'm struggling to discern these letters, yet they've written it. And they've written it on cloth. 800 years ago uh, large crown scroll in Nashki script on cotton from India um, a rare example of the entire text of the Quran written in miniature uh, it's right in minute Nashki script in black ink on white painted cotton set with 169 square compartments it, 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 it's just the intricacy of this is just mind-blowing and then you have the 99 names of Allah all the way around the side. But the tiny... Uh, this is It's just extraordinary. And this will be rolled up and carried. I just... Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. It's, it's beyond words. It's, um, Alhamdulillah, it's absolutely amazing. Uh, we could just stay here for the whole trip. It's just mind blowing, isn't it? It's incredible. What a I gift! Love it. What a gift! Love it. Uh, and uh, here uh, it's just tucked away. Yeah. And as you drive up to the building, you would never no. even imagine. No. All of this is down here, and this is one room. It's absolutely staggering. So it, it, it's it's mind blowing, and it's the, the influence of Islam and Islamic art on culture throughout the. I say decades, centuries, in fact, millennia. Uh, and it is, it, it's, it's, it's mind blowing. It's absolutely, absolutely incredible. What a joy. Yeah, we were just admiring it, saying there's so many things to focus on and then your eyes drawn to something. This is a carved buffalo hide, uh, uh, carved buffalo hide and leather shield it's over 500 years old. Mm -hmm. And the intricacy that you're seeing, the carving on what is in on effect hide. leather, the carving on hide uh, depicts four windows from Sidi Said's mosque in Ahmedabad. Yeah. Each of these arched semicircular forms are decorated with stylized trees, undulating snake-like branches, inspired by palm trees. What? This is 500 years ago. And it looks like it could have been done today. It's just staggering. We were also struck by this picture, but actually the, the background, because this is Lady Jane Digby El Messer, painted by the well-known uh, Oriental artist Karl Haag. But she was married to Sheikh, Mi, uh, Sheikh Miguel El Messer of Palmria. Uh, whose portrait is also uh, uh, along, alongside us here, 1859. Uh, but this is, uh, uh, well, Lady Jane Digby, who married a sheikh and spent her life as Muslim. This is in 1859. Extraordinary. Lady Jane Digby. Uh, so she'd have been almost like the royal family. Mm. Well, in the UK, well, Lady yeah, Jane is yeah. English, isn't it? Yes. Uh, I've never heard of her. And look at her. And there's her husband. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, what journey she must have been on. Mm -hmm. And look, if you look at the way that she's painted, she's very spiritual. Mm -hmm. You can see the painter has given her an almost like like a Mary, mother of Jesus. Yes. Sort of, mm, yeah. sort of you know, calmness to her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Absolutely fascinating. So this is the wonderful museum that we've just been in and I'm going to dice with death and just meander back across this road just to let you know you, 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 you wouldn't necessarily know that it was here it's just extraordinary and the, the, the wealth 
of art and knowledge inside this building this unassuming building is staggering and it's been an absolute joy we're incredibly grateful to our host uh, for, for bringing us and showing us this it's, it's staggering it's amazing amazing so onwards what could possibly be next so we really hope you enjoyed that for the 21 video series everything you ever wanted to know about Islam and the Muslim culture but couldn't be bothered to ask click the link in the top right of the screen also, please subscribe by clicking the red button below if you haven't already done so. We want to reach as many people as we possibly can. Thank you once again for your support and we'll see you in the next video. Assalamu alaikum. Wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.